see if Reed can make another upset happen. This is Cody, one of the most formidable peaches in Tri-State. This queen is certainly a boss, especially with that explosive ass combo advantage state they got going on. And we're gonna see it, but nope. Reed shutting it down immediately with the Mitra cheating in question, that foresight, which is so, so good. I'm very curious to see how Reed is gonna do against Cody. And uh, honestly, so far, they're doing pretty damn good. This character does do well against Peach. They're able to kind of just outframe out of them and mash all over this character. But it's like things, situations like these, where you get into disadvantage with Mithra Pyra, where it's like you got to question your life choices because they do have the Cloud Syndrome. And if you're not careful while you're recovering, you can eat a mighty punish. But Reed able to make it back with the Photon finish. All right. Recovery looking solid as well. Cody forced to respect the Pyra here until they can finally find that opening because his character is so, so explosive, much like that forwarder with the Rage taking the first stock. And let's see if Cody can take this first one here. Oh, buffer the air dodge, thinking they would tech as well. Oh my god, <laughs> the, the footstools are so funny. There's nothing is happening. It's just like cute little damage, but oh, the advantage state going crazy just a little bit. But Reed saying, nah, I don't care about any of your games. Hold this down air into the up smash. Very good stuff, just some solid damage. Trying to get the ledge trump down air going around. Very fast option that you, I honestly did not expect to see, but I'm definitely still in that one for myself. Yep, foresight. Gotta love him doing cheating moves. Reed not positioning themselves correctly to get that F tilt. And catching Cody committing to the turn of plot, this is gonna do them so well. And now having the Pyra getting the frame trapping on. This is looking like a Reed run tonight, honestly. If Reed's able to get this game one, I think it might be pretty damn clean. But Cody is trying to fight Reed for this game one currently. Not able to get their combo game rolling, getting the parry. I love that upbeat out of shield usage. But it is a fairly committal thing if you're not very careful with the ones that you place around. It does have a big scoop. Yep, frame trapping in question. Reed trying to cover their options all around with the air dodge as well. This pirate play looking very smart out here. Yep, and this is your opportunity with the trap with the down there, but no Cody. Coming in with that Peach Bump. Good in the good old side view Leonard Rock and catching the jump as well. This is your opportunity to kill Reed, but nope. Cody respecting the, the recovery on back. Reed trying to slide in there. Get some Pyra damage going on. There we go. Throw, toss her in the corner. Is he going to get it? Hangs around town for the fair. It's not going to be the closer yet, folks. Back throw. What option is Cody going to make? Reed can't be overzealous with this commitment here because they basically have the game in the palm of their hands. But now it is turned around. Cody looking to get it, but Promise Revolt is going to be putting in that work. And now we have a game two. I'm very uh, optimistic for Reed to... Um, do very well in the set because one thing that I've noticed about Cody is against well it's kind of a general weakness for Peach as well when they get trapped by sword characters like this and characters who kind of have that superior frame data they really kind of just get run over and they're very susceptible to just getting just trapped in an endless loop where it's like please what do I do help me bro get me out of this state what's up Noku let's go Tyler Man, I'm stuck in this cycle, and I, I oh, not no, a cycle, bro. it's not a cycle, it's more just like, I, I get in my own head in the middle of the match, and I'm just like. <laughs> I'm already out of bracket! Damn, bro. <laughs> what the hell? Your training Anyways. partner is trying to tell you a DQ. Thanks for my training partner. <laughs> and, I, and I just need to like, get better at playing certain matches, that's it. Playing zoners, that's my, wow. I've been you're, a, you're a rush down zoner. I am a rush down zoner, and that's my thing. I play too much like a rush down. There's so many situations where it's just like, I don't need to dash like every time. I can grab, 
Yeah. It's like, you can do it. You just have to, like, cycle between, like, oh my god. Cody! The bomb! Oh! Anyway, what I was saying about Reed before, uh, sorry, you, your, your skill loses to RNG, my friend. It's okay, bro. Anyways, Reed's Pyra is, I've said, I say this every time he's on stream, Reed's Pyra is his best character. It's not his Mithra. Even though his Mithra is, like, nothing to sleep at, like, his Mithra combos are insane, but, like, he just plays the best, or in my opinion, better, with his Pyra. But, you know, um, it kind of doesn't matter when Peach is pressing buttons on his shield, you're at her mercy. Yep. Especially, like, it. when the, the driver is freaking Cody. And Reed realized that, so we have to get on to an, it's an even cheater play, playing field. Yeah, the even cheater playing field being that fourth side in question and this Pyro, which is currently on out. Promise Revolt, though, gonna make Reed get back to ledge, but now this is the problem. You always just have to escape the ledge as Aegis against Peach. Yeah, and it's so it's so hard, like, getting out of the corner. But look at this man. Oh my god, that freight trap was nuts! But, like, Reed just couldn't capitalize so much. And nice fade back, knowing the grab was coming too. Oh, oh dot eyes! Cleaning was, this uh, up. Anyway, we'll, we'll, we'll get him next time. We'll, we'll get him the next game. No worry, though. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, I, I was scared. I was scared. Like, I, I know what Cody does on these platforms. And that that would have been a zero to death. Oh, you already know. Reed. Even off the down tilts as well. You get yes. so much damage off that. And trying to trap Reed in a little bit of frame trap with that there. But okay. F tilt, finally going to take a stop. That's good. And now, you know, finally doing what he's trying to do since, like, the beginning. But it, the, the thing is, like, Cody cheesed him, so Reed was probably in his head. And his head is like, I need to kill him, like, now. So he kept, as you saw earlier, he kept trying to go for down airs. And then we finally stopped that I was able to actually start playing the game. Oh my god. That's master, you kidding? Oh. Cody is swinging at Reed right now. And I honestly, I fucked with it hard. I mean, 152, like, get this get this queen out of here, bro. Not for real. All right, but then there's a pistol DP. That thing works. Oh. No, but ah, you saw him go for the pivot grab, too. Damn, that's uh, tough, man. I would have done the same thing. Yes. I was saying, this matchup is like suit, kind of like, it's winning for ages, but in a sense, it's also volatile. I don't think it's winning for ages. Really? I don't think so. Because there was like, and it, you remember like early Ultimate? Where yeah. Where everyone just thought that Peach auto loses to swords? Aegis falls into the category of, of like swordies that Peach would, that Peach would auto lose to at the beginning of Ultimate, right? Because yeah. it's just like Peach does not have range. Peach, um, and the swordies got like range of disjoints, whatever, right? But, uh, Peach has some of the most insane sealed pressure and pre and commanding presence in neutral that I have seen in this game, especially now. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't know what's been going on. It's like Sam Sora left, and then all these other Peach players are just like Mutes and Cody. Yo, I'm trying to get my like, neutral up. Like, listen, yo, no, that's like Sam was neutral. Then the character's like, yo, how bullshit is Peach? How bullshit is this character? Oh, and my right lord, we've seen how much damage, how much is nonsense this character can shit out. Yeah, and I'm a little concerned because I I think Peach does very, very well on the stage. And it's one of those things, like you were saying, these two characters are forced to play neutral with the platforms being off to the side. Yes. It's a matter of, like, can you get those neutral interactions? Can you get that trapping on that will just keep your opponent in, like, an endless loop? And right now it's Cody take off to a very phenomenal start on Reed, but Reed trying to turn this around real quick. Listen, he's still turning around. He's actually keeping it, like, keeping the pace very even. It's like, he's, like, caught onto, like, oh, it's Cody, like, a spot dots. Look at this shit. Spot dots, Oof. spot dots, spot dots, still. This young Link. Um, he's, he's caught up with like, you know, Cody like his spot thousand and everything like that. He's catching his defensive habits really well. So like, he's just probably one of the neutral stage where it's like, I'm not gonna die to some like, cheesy piece platform nonsense. Yeah, it's really what's gonna help here with Reed is like, oh my god, bro, fun. why? It's because like, he had the parry, but it, oh my god. But just a bit too late on the punish. I'm so you know, sad. He's gonna stay on power for a while, but this is tough. Uh oh, uh oh. This is very tough. Oh my god. Honestly. I understand this is Reed, but at percentages like this, the 73, dog, you got to switch out to Mithra. But all right, not getting caught on the switch here. Now you have to play this out very careful with the Mithra, with the 114, you know. It's pirate time. What oh, you talking about? Nah. It's, yeah. it's time to go to bed. It's not time to, to go to bed. Ah, too. I forgot about the head scars, too. Like, you missed Ledge Beach is murdering you. Yeah, no. It's because Aegis just suffers from Cloud Syndrome and... You already know how Peach operates with the turnips and everything. Can oh, use that yeah. flow to just hang around and be like, oh, you're trying to recover? That's cute, bro. Hold this Nair, hold this Nair, like hold the turnip. Bro, it's like Cody's mixing Reed up on his recovery every single time. Because we saw at the beginning of the game, it was even. And then not even not even two minutes have passed yet. Look at the look how just like different this game is now. 
Yeah, there was just this zealous nature that Reed had to them that it kind of just let go once Cody was able to like just play their game properly and just go to town with the advantage state. But okay, finally a stock. Let's see if it can happen. But first, you got to come back from this ledge. Yeah. All right, never mind. It's not happening there. Goodbye, my friend. That's tough. So long, farewell. Avida said, I do. <laughs> I do. I do. To you and you and you. Now, and but out. I, uh, why I think.